really cherish and value um, three standards. It's pride, standard, and unity, and uh, that's our motto for this year. And we call ourselves a tribe, not so much a team, because a, a team is a collective people, yes, but a tribe, you work together and you stand behind each other's backs. And so we're very, um, we're very optimistic and very more so like how football likes to call themselves a brotherhood. We're so much like a sisterhood, and so that's what our tribe is. We're a family. And as a as a woman, you got to prove that you are as good as anybody else. And so softball is a lot of compared to baseball, and so it's kind of interesting. I mean, when you tell somebody, or when I tell somebody, I'm on the softball team, and they're like, "Oh, it's just like baseball." If they've never seen softball before, and I'm like, "Nah, no, <laughs> not really." But um, I don't know, as a woman, you kind of just stand your ground and you kind of just be like, you know what, this is who I am and this is who I'm going to be and you show up every day to the field and that's who you are. It's empowering, um, showing you that you can do anything that you put your mind to. Um, in fact, yesterday we just had an alumni come around, her name was Erin, I cannot remember her last name, but um, her, she has survived cancer five times and her and her husband um, started their own entrepreneurship and she was here speaking at Penn State yesterday just talking about the different stages of life and just talking about the different um, motivations that got her going and I just think it was incredible to see a woman who played here at Penn State and then battled cancer five times and was told she wasn't going to have a family and she had a daughter yesterday and so I mean it's just empowering. Um, being an athlete kind of just shows you the ropes of how reality is. Um, you're put into a situation where you, you're on this team with 20 other girls. For me, it's 20 other girls and eight other staff members. And you're kind of just thrown into this reality of, you know what, you're going to be an adult and you need to grow up. Um, but to get you prepared for the next level, it's incredible. It's unlike anything else because I mean, you're, you have these responsibilities. You have, um, <laughs> you, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> You have these responsibilities and you have these directions that you know you, that you need to go and how to get there. It just teaches you how to be an adult, really.